All right, everyone. It is me, Jensen Chan. Oh, so, actually, woke up right on this at nine forty as the uh, alarm clock blared off. But I did go to bed kind of early yesterday too. So, you know, just uh, I definitely am feeling the effects of not having my protein. You know, even though yesterday was my workout day, but uh, uh, as you already know listening and watching to a lot of TEDx talks or Joe Rogan's uh, podcast, but I really needed my games yesterday, so I so I worked on my game a little bit yesterday. And today, I'm not sure what I'll work on, uh, if at all, but maybe the same thing. Just a little out of time. What matters is I actually keep doing something. You know, it's, it's like, you know, Scott Adams says, you want a system, not necessarily a goal. A goal, you know, I mean, uh, back then, a goal was fun because life was simpler. But today, things are much more complex. You know, if you want to maintain meaning in your life, you need a system. So, you know, just do a little bit every day. And it's just like, oh, yeah, you know, because, yeah, now I'm a computer programmer because I just do stuff, right? You know, I, I, I don't know, for some reason, ever, ever since I just heard Elon Musk talk about stuff, right? And he just says, we just need to make stuff. I don't know, it's really sticking with me. That's probably because I really like Elon Musk. Uh, <clears throat> And then, uh, yeah, so I, want, I also noticed he still actually replies to people in his Twitter, even though he's got like 34 million followers. So, <clears throat> so yeah, of course, I use Twitter normally, too. And I kind of noticed, yeah, when I get bigger and more famous, I'm going to have, like, and I still kind of want to do that. I'm, like, I'm, I'm actually going to have some issues. It's like, hey, it's going to be pretty time consuming. So I'm going to do a couple replies, right? And then number two, how do I, what do I do about, sorting the idiots from the insulters to the people I would normally block or mute. It's like, you know, how do I handle that? Because, you know, if I'm wasting time with that, then I'm not really wasting time actually replying to people that, you know, that might actually would be help the reply. Your reply would actually help a lot of our people. So it's like, hmm. I uh, so I have to think about that. I have to think about that. So anyway, yesterday was a really long video. I think only three people actually watched it and then some F word downloaded it for some reason. So anyway, I, I kind of want to just relax today. Uh, try to do a kind of quickish video, so we'll see. All right. So last week was 18. So Google hasn't released this week's uh, Bitcoin interest. Uh, it's you know one day after the halving, and so far so good. Bitcoin downs out 67.1 percent. 24 hours at 168.2 billion. Uh, Bitcoin's at 88.77. Uh, so far, so good. Litecoin's at 42.52. So everyone's just kind of just like the day after. So I guess they're just going to take a chill, which is fine because we're not going to be reopening for a while. I mean, for a while, is in a couple of weeks. In fact, Mayor, Cu uh, Mayor Cuomo, Andrew Cuomo actually said that the lockdown in New York is actually going to officially end on May 15th. So that's in three days. So I guess he must have bumped it up at some point. Uh, from the end of May. So, you know, e even he's accelerating the reopening. Um, so, works for me. Doggy coin, 311.8 million. Um, Hive is at 32.89 cents. So, boy, this thing is just dropping. But so is everything else. Uh, Steam. Where's Steam? Steam is at 16.64 cents. So, pretty much, if you look at the spark line on the right, it's pretty much following what everyone else is doing. So, uh, so this is good. This is good. I'm still expecting a massive drop, and I don't really see it. So maybe the massive drop was already done. This one where it hit 10K and then just goes down to what it is now. So, all right, I'll take that. That's not that bad. Uh, markets are completely uh, neutral. So that's interesting. We're going to read that. Um, Merging with blank check firm Collier. UTZ. Is that the chip maker? Potato chip. I really want to try chips. Yes, it's the chip maker. UTZ actually makes some good food. Like, uh, like they use real ingredients. They don't add any extra shit, too much extra shit. So, like, when I go to the store and buy chips, I buy my Lay's uh, or I buy the Market Pantry because that's the generic brand from Target. Or, you know, I buy UTZ. Usually, UTZ is very, uh, very little. Uh, okay, I better not look at this because what's going to happen is I'm going to start getting hungry. Oh, I also wanted to say, like, I'm paraphrasing a little bit, but a TED Talk actually said the battle, uh, he didn't say the battle, but I call it the battle because that's really what it is. The battle for weight loss is won or lost at the supermarket. <laughs> oh, yeah, now I remember. It was the Warren Buffett uh, TED Talk. 
I like a guy talking about him. And uh, yeah, like, because you, because again, we all know we have limited willpower. So the best thing to do is to actually just not buy it. So it's not in your house. You can't binge on ice cream if it's not in your, if you don't even have ice cream to begin with. Now, I've tried that before. It's actually the best method. The problem is eventually you get so cravings for it that your next time the next supermarket you will buy it. So it, it's really just a deterrent. Uh, yeah. Anyway, three reasons investors think stocks are why Trump's tax returns still matter. UTG and merger tax. Uh, Elon Musk to Pfizer reopens California plant. Yes, yeah, so I actually would have been retweeting him. So, uh, yeah, and nothing happened. Like, the cops didn't even bother arresting him. Uh, and then, uh, so that's how it works. Yeah, that's the only thing, that's the only shitty thing about re retweeting replies. They don't actually show you the original uh, thing you're replying to, which is this stupid F-word idiot. Uh, so, yeah. But Eli gets a lot of hate, so. Uh, let's see. Uh, so, yeah, nothing new with Trump there. Forge CEO says it's a couple of unprecedented data. Oh, before we move on, why Trump's tax returns still matter. So we're actually going back to normal. The fact that they're running stupid shit like this. All right? And then, of course, nothing's going to come of Obamagate, you know. So. so, yeah, actually, that does make sense. Richard Nixon went to prison for less. And I guess the joke is, yeah, he never went to prison. He just resigned. <laughs> so... Mnuchin says Treasury sent money for Fed's corporate loans. Treasury said he sent the Federal Reserve money from a bullet rescue package in the U.S. court during his work with the Senate since, since uh, this is 21 hours ago. This is old. I don't want to read this. More than Kelly needs Elon Musk. Uh, yeah, a lot of assholes are just slamming Elon Musk. Like, and on top of that, as he has already said, a lot of people, I mean, all car manufacturers are good to go in California, except Tesla. Like, what, why is that? Tesla is a green, is a much, definitely a green company. So I know it's not global warming bullshit, right? Um, which I'm still, which I still would like to look at, but the problem is it's so politicized and so much propaganda that, like, I can't get, I won't be able, I know I won't be able to get an accurate uh, read about the CO2 levels because actually the what the weight the mathematics of weight loss TED talk actually said uh, most 84 percent of your weight loss comes through breathing like literally breathing right uh, it's the final process between eating less calories or eating less than you normally would and moving around a, a lot that's it that's all that weight loss is in the simplest terms uh, and then when once you have those two pr precursors then when you breathe, you actually breathe it out as carbon dioxide. So he was asked, does weight loss cause global warming or climate change? And people were laughing. And I thought, yeah, this actually sounds like it would at least increase CO2 levels. And, and he said something about it's different because the food we're eating was made by plants a couple years ago. So it's not a not problem. The problem is the fossil fuels that were made millions of years ago when we burned that. The carbon dioxide from so apparently carbon dioxide has like from age is what causes problems so um yeah so like so when you so when you hear dumb cunts like aoc saying well we must have less people to prevent climate change she's really referring to the fact that you know we breathe out carbon dioxide uh so yeah uh <laughs> yeah so it's, it's it's interesting. It's interesting. Keeping an open mind does lead you to interesting things. It also makes me realize why left wing f words become the way they are because like because the Republicans and people on the right do the to do the op do the same thing. They just refuse to listen to the other side, and then you know you have uh, then you have people going to the extremes, and then we all get screwed in the ass with our consent. Uh, yeah, but with that being said, you know, um, still not being a war tree hugging, worshiping. Oh, we gotta start building, building solar panels everywhere. You know, I personally like would like solar panels. Um, also, I'm not sure. Does burning gas like the I don't I don't I don't know anything about I don't know too much about fracking, but like the consumption of natural gas. I mean, that probably burns. Um, CO2 as well, but I'm not sure if it's as bad as gasoline or oil. All right, so anyway, there's that. Uh, GMC's at six to seven. It's actually six to nine. Yeah, this is really small. Yeah, so GMC's been doing really well. Uh, yeah, that works for me. 
Crux is two to three. Crux. Four of four is two to three. Though I guess if you're patient, you could wait at four, but I'm definitely waiting at three. Uh, two by two, you know, solid as always, 66 to 68 or 67. Top pound coin is 48, well, 4,900 to 5,800. So yeah, it's doing what it always does. Nothing new here on my channel. Uh, let's see. So everyone's still talking about the halving. Uh, halving Zapata, Sisters, Exiki. Did I? I'm pretty sure I must have refreshed this. I'm going to do this again. Uh, as long as I could understand about the negative rates, you guys should also accept the gift. Big numbers. Uh, yeah, well, sure. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. So even fucking Trump's tweeting about Elon Musk. Oh, yeah. Oops. I meant to click Elon Musk here. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Crude oil prices going up a sunny cuts for never green. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, what's called? I don't know. Remember Tony Tiffany? God, uh, dude, I wouldn't. <sighs> Tony Tiffany. <laughs> Uh, I would never let my... See, if you do need gender neutral, you should make it your last name so that people don't automatically assume that you're a woman when in this case, this guy's obviously a man. <laughs> uh, see, that's the real discussion about gender neutrality we should, be have, <laughs> we should be talking about. Men given women's names and vice versa. Though I guess it's generally not nearly as bad if you do that with the first name. Like, say, Taylor Swift, right? Taylor is... I always assumed Taylor was a man's name, but, you know. And then you have Kelly, which is also uh, a woman's name, but apparently there are some men that are named Kelly. Uh, I personally would not do that, all right? Because I want to make sure that people straight up know they're dealing with a man or a woman, all right? So, yeah. Uh, D D D Oh, you right. Every girl who had sky hair on their hand cry and very hard work and all kinds of stuff. Oh, 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 Bad, and then we get drop kicked in the face. And then we get drop kicked in the face on the street. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's exactly what's fucking happening. Uh. Oh yeah. I forget. Of course, the thing is, people might interpret that as like, what's going on? <laughs> but what are exactly? Uh, yeah, I've noticed he didn't actually say senile, right? Um, but I mean, you do want to be a little careful too. So it's, it, it's a little tough. But uh, there was one thing he also tweeted that I wanted to read. Oh yeah, it was up here. Maybe people are warriors. Transition to greatness. Ooh. I like keep spamming my Twitter, but which, eh, okay, you know what, whatever, I don't give a shit, I just, uh, yeah, well, of course everyone's, well, it's not like us Republicans have a choice anyway, of course we're going to approve of what Trump's doing, I call it right, NBC, uh, yeah, I guess I don't really care. Uh, by the way, I am pretty appreciative that he does this because this should help alleviate. This should reduce the amount of drop kicks to the face that us Asians have to deal with, All right? You know, a you gotta like empathize, understand other people are mad, at China or Chinese people in general, but then just say you know, oh, but there's a distinction here, and then it's like you know, fifty fifty. And also, Trump also said, go ask China to that stupid fucking left wing. I think CBS. Uh, Wei Zheng or whatever her name was, cut um, reporter, and then I don't. I mean, I don't think it was intentional, but I mean, Trump probably just. I mean, obviously, Trump just you know just got fucking mad, and he even just left after uh, Caitlin Collins wanted to ask him a question. He's like, "Yeah, fuck this, uh, you know." Oh yeah, I, I better be careful. I don't want to get banned off. <laughs> I don't want my shit to get censored. Uh, tonight it's emotion. <clears throat> 
Wow. Now this is something I will definitely retweet. Rose McGowan, the founder of this. Uh, uh, I guess, actually, Jesus. See, this is what feminazism does to you. Uh, I would have died for this damn country. It's ideal. It's ideal. What? Oh, actually, you know what? This is so important, actually. Well, so much for cleaning up my uh, Twitter. And thus, the Democrat Party ceased to exist in the... Alright, this is actually interesting. I never would have thought something like this would happen. I would, this is also why having empathy is actually pretty good because she actually has some and now she realizes maybe what I'm doing is wrong, right? Now, I'm not saying she's a conservative, but she'll, you know, we can push her in that direction eventually. And then, of course, she'll actually be a decent looking woman instead of whatever the fuck the hell she's doing there. Uh, I would have died for this day because when my youngest brother graduated as a fighter pilot. Wow. So she definitely had some kind of exposure to right wing types. I wore a John Kerry pin, verbal of a big man or man was Democrat shit lib. Or twice my head to listen to George Bush give the keynote address and okay, okay I lost count. Okay, okay, blah blah blah. And I would choose those who lined up with my own, but what if there were there's no all because I thought democracy meant was I had a right to choose those who lined up with my value system. But what if there's no one? And I was told, was told it was a Democrat shit lit party or a good guy that our pipers were these stupid F words. And we talk about how much we love. Okay. Um, I really feel quite a sense of loss today. I'm not single probably America guy. Yeah, I have always been painted as a bad guy. I always seen him as more of a cub. And I really so are the Democrat kind of shit lips. Macro Michael, this is deeper than a cover, and I'm sad because there's death all around. Of course, it's shown in the daytime, it hurts. Minus 1000. Wait, did she write this on Twitter? Wait, you have one, you can have 1000 uh, character thing jigs on your thing? Or maybe that was her. Okay. Ah, so she's she's siding with Tara Reid, which is actually the correct move because her shit sounds credible, as annoying as it is. Um, of course, I know what the Nick Fuentes take is, which is also ultimately correct too. Like we can't have women just accusing every man running for office of rape and whatever. Just that that's so it's like it's just like what what the fuck do you do? Yeah, I don't see anything here. Also, I always like doggy. Okay, it's one. Okay, I know what's gonna happen. I know what's gonna happen. We, we I try to keep this shorter. We're at eighteen minutes and fifteen seconds. Uh, these are off to the lobby of apartment building. They are outside about ripes for hard I crooked. I know it's a pocket of it, but eventually this girl could come to bite in the ass to play that game. Yeah, the Democrats are gonna. Yeah, if they're gonna start stealing votes, we're just gonna start stealing votes too. I mean, I mean, at this point, we're not a fucking democracy. <laughs> That is that really. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, let's take a look. Oh yes, this is actually what we're looking for. Because uh, I actually, I actually like this picture. Uh, where is New York City at? Four of seven. Okay. Capital region. So finger. So here. All right. So three regions are already. So, Southern New York, Mid-Hudson, Long Island, wow, even Long Island's almost ready to reopen. Central New York and Capital Region. So, basically, New York is going to reopen pretty soon. And this Friday is going to be very warm weather. So, I mean, at this point, you know, everything that's like the flu, including coronavirus, is just going. All right, I'm going to actually unretweet that. Um, say because I know no one's going to read it. So, I, I, it's not worth my Twitter real estate space. Uh, okay, interesting. So New York City, where is New York? Great, I'm gonna guess you're right in the middle, right? X, 3.4, new hospitalizations under, okay, that's a three day, okay. So we're close to the th under three mark. Share of total beds available, under 30%. Very good, share of ICU beds. We need 30%, this is 24%. Uh, 30 per 1K tested, blah, 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 blah. So our testing's pretty good. 
this is going to be tough. Like, well, I mean, enough people are uh, are going to choose to get tested because one of the things I'm going to have a real problem with is mandatory testing. Like, yeah, you know, like, and the coronavirus testing, it's really like they jam a lot of shit up your nostrils and it hurts. So it's basically mandatory torture. Ugh, boy. Uh, expect con contract tracers 30 per 100k or, or, or yeah he used to have a number it was very high it's like what like I, I don't I don't understand what this metric is uh, fourth set all right very good um, done your goal open state all right certain allies include oh okay very well open certain uh, statewide serial always busy recreational activities as of May 15th. Landscape gardening, drive in movie theaters. Uh, do we? I'm surprised we even have these. Like, we still have these? Uh, yes. Okay, very good. As of May 15th. All right. All right. Okay, very good. Very good. Um, all right, so let's move on. Uh, okay, I'm sure this is new regulations, three traps to avoid. Yes, okay, so that was correct. A bit of digital gold. Okay, but we'll have nothing here. Uh, Mike, now regards for both having been at, no, I don't have anything. Yeah, I'm not interested in what he has. Uh, Ta da, that was Bitcoin, and you're sparking wall time. Yeah, letting Bitcoin, and when you need Bitcoin, I'm going to say now has lower inflation rate than gold. Yes, it does. Uh, calls cash a wasting hammer, how much Bitcoin he's been buying. Um, it's not a wasting asset, right? I mean, it wasn't a wasting asset during coronavirus. So, you know, it's just that you just, you hold cash and then you wait for the opportunity to buy something up uh, better than cash. Otherwise, cash is always pretty much king. Uh, become ourselves in mass. Because again, all asset classes have a use, right? You know, just like, you know, just like in real life, you know, people, we need police officers, we need firefighters, we need computer programmers, we need doctors, we need lawyers, we need everybody, all right? One is obviously better than the other in doing certain tasks, but they're obviously not suited for everything else. So you can't judge the uh, people with different specializations. And it's the same thing with money, right? Cash ha is very useful for a lot of things. It's generally pretty bad for other things, namely... Um, you know, uh, uh, making more of itself, right? You actually have to spend money to make a lot more money, right? But the problem is, what do you spend it on, right? So, you know, and real estate's great for a lot of things, but it's also pretty shitty in other ways too, especially for beginners like me and I assume a lot of you, right? Which is, yeah, it's pretty expensive to get started, but if you can do, if, you, if you're able to do it and make a profit, it's probably a good idea to do real estate because that's where you can hold your value, your net worth, right? Because money will come and go, but your real estate is much more likely to stay, right? Until you decide to sell it, hopefully for a higher price, you know, year, uh, later down the line, years down the line. Uh, okay, so nothing new there. We already went through these two uh, Twitters. So, uh, yes, yeah. stock market news, live updates, stocks rise with states reopening plan in focus. Stocks rose Tuesdays. Just to continue, I state to reopen floods, bull research, uh, market power also at the start of the Fed Reserve program to purchase corporate debt ETFs when kick off, which kicks off, is that today? That's today. Hmm. Earlier, U.S. equity futures traded lower during the overnight session following a Fox business report that Trump at Min was seeking to keep federal employee retirement funds from being in invested in Chinese equities, raising concerns and tensions would rise between the two countries. That's actually a smart uh, thing to do. And, it's actually, and that's actually what you should be doing. Man, even the retirement accounts. God, even the, our retirement accounts are invested in China. Ah, oh, jeez. Earlier, earlier, U.S. equity futures traded lower during the overnight session following a Trump admin was seeking to keep federal employment retirement from... Oh, this is only for federal shit. Oh, okay. Oh, well, I don't really care. It's not... I mean, it's a chunk, but the private sector is still bigger. One day stocks in and sessions mixed. Um, also had a positive day. Big shares to, of course, outperform. 
Uh, Nasdaq was up for six straight today. It's the longest winning streak so far in 2020 in New York. Said to everybody that survey each other's will be ready, right? We already ran over this. Well, I will not apply New York City. Yeah, we're at, what was it, four, seven, or five or seven? Oh, yeah, it's probably four or seven. But we're getting pretty close to six of seven. So I just don't know the contract tracer thing. But he said it was expected, and then the next one seems to be yes, because the number didn't make any sense. New York State as a whole counted. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Since, yeah, okay. Yeah, so it's actually dropping the number of deaths from coronavirus. And of course, we know they're cooking the books. So, um, because if you just happen to have it and you have other uh, diseases, you know, it counts as a coronavirus death. So, as we already know from Elon Musk's Joe Rogan interview, it's because of the way the uh, coronavirus relief package by Congress is set up. So, hospitals are incentivized to cook numbers. Uh, in earnings statements and calls and da 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 da, these go to the most here. Also, I'm planning to quarterly operating results, suggesting a return back to parallels will take time. Yeah, I just give it three or six months. Uh, separately, as you know, last week said during the company's going to the real estate market is predominantly open. It's clear that we have passed peaked fear. Yeah, I mean, the worst has been over. Um,. Uh, yeah, here's the thing. I don't understand why they're singling out Tesla. Uh, they said that selling clean manufacturer will be allowed to resume. Uh, uh, this is spare the ire of Elon Musk. We found plenty of sticks here over a week. Third to recall, however, the state has already started production of the fear has already defined the orders. Good. Uh, we already know that. And then, okay, I don't need to know the other stuff. All right, let's see. Let's let's end this on the stupidity of the Yahoo comments. <coughs> Features will gradually be forced up overnight, a little vomit, like always, and they'll stay put, a little trailer, like always, perfect over the PP, uh, what? F features hires the Fed could choose to rig the stock, considering rich black, not over a while, okay, it is. The argument against giving bail to actual people instead of corporate is that. If you give bail to corporate, you're also going to keep the employees of payroll, but the exact, I think he means opposite, he must have forgotten the word, but the exact how employees still get fired, companies still cut jobs, operating against bail, companies buy their own stock. Oh yeah, I would actually upvote that. I'll call the fan let them know that features are out, but to be fair, I think a lot of people are keeping employees too. I do see a lot of articles about that. So, I mean, so, so, some companies are scumbag efforts. I'll call the fan let them know the features so they can fix it. <laughs> fix it. I thought the one where you have uh, headline stocks would be up, down. Yeah, it's just... <laughs> <laughs> At this point, we just don't know. <laughs> I'll just the area there that I'll just go whether we have a V, U, or W shape or card. So I guess that makes no one an expert. LOL. So let's talk about the area, but wait, this is the area's chain. Area out the window. Okay. The theory of the absurd so stuck. Okay. Please, no more students. I want somebody who's not going to review any anyway. Yes, we teach fed, but it is not acceptable. Just say no. Um, I mean, technically, it does flow to the people. It doesn't flow to everybody. And of course, it's still best to. Give directly to the people, but of course, most of the F word, old type boomer idiot is in the Republican Party, like Mitch McCuckle and Lindsey Graham, especially, are just like, no, the people cannot have free money, period. Give it to all of the businesses and our donors. Oh, God. Like, is it like, you know, just like Chinese Americans like me are mad at China, right? You know, the fucking Oscars are mad at Lindsey Graham for the exact same kind of reason. They make us look bad, so everyone just thinks we're all like that. Um, uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, uh, I don't want to read anymore. All right, so, yeah, we did pretty well. We made it pretty, uh, pretty small. I don't even know what we're going to title this, but... Uh, I don't know, I kind of want to make the Rose McGowan thing kind of like, because that's actually a pretty big deal. Like, that's a really big deal. Um, yeah, I, this is, I might actually consider making this the thumbnail, because this is really important. Plus, you know, you can probably get a few extra hits. If you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, or subscribe button from wherever you're watching this from, or on my YouTubes at youtube.com forward slash JMC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page. Yeah, so you do actually. Uh... Oh, God, that is so expensive. I kind of need these raid pieces. Uh, I completely lost track of them. <laughs> I got my, uh, got, uh, yeah, all right, let's just, uh, let's just do this. All right. Uh, yeah, just, just subscribe on the right hand side of this page. All right. Just continue growing the channel.
Anyway, uh, all right, we came in under, at least normal-ish. So basically, nothing's gonna happen. It's like it's the aftermath. Things are reopening. Fundamentals are getting stronger. So if I had to guess, I would say maybe another week or two at most. Maybe th definitely no longer than three weeks. But who knows? Maybe things will just simply shoot back up uh, later this week. Uh, I did forget to mention, as, as you noticed, after a big move and a flat line, that's usually pretty good uh, for us. But we know we're in a bull run, so. This flat line, the more it flat lines, the better, because it's just, you know, recovering, resting. It's just like exercising, right? It's just catching its breath, right? And it looks like the stock markets are also doing exactly the same thing. So eventually it's going to start shooting back up. So it's just in the, it's just in the rest and recovery uh, phase. I think it's called R&R, &R, right? So what do you, I, I, I really hate autoplay. R&R &R military stands for... Pretty sure it's rest and recovery or rest and recuperation okay but yeah it's basically the same thing r and r oh so, yeah i did say r and r so that's exactly what's happening here so pretty solid you know but I need that money i need that money right you know mitch is still working on the wallet so hopefully by the time we're ready to do the swap bitcoin will be like 16 grand i mean that's a kind of long shot so soon but you never know Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching. And, uh, I mean, unless you want to buy, which would actually probably be an okay time to buy. Yeah, I'm just sitting tight, you know. Just, we're just waiting for everything to go back up. See you all tomorrow. Thanks. Chunsa Chad, JMC Coin, 404 Coin. Uh, oh, yeah, we're going with the Rose McGowan thing. So, yeah.